Hi, I'm Nettie from the user operations team at Paystack. Today, I'm going to show you how to connect your Paystack business to HubSpot CRM using Zapier. HubSpot CRM is basically a tool that a lot of businesses use to manage relationships with their customers. Right now, I'm logged into Zapier and the first thing we're going to do is to click right here and make a zap. So, once the page loads up, we're going to have to choose a trigger app. In this case, Paystack. So, we're going to have to select a trigger. In this case, we want to ensure that when a customer is created on Paystack, the same customer details are also registered on HubSpot CRM. There are a lot of things that we can actually do with Zapier, but for this video, this is what we're going to focus on. So I click here, save and continue. Now, the next thing I'm going to need to do is to connect a Paystack account. So what I'm going to need to do is to put in my live secret key. So I come over to settings, API keys and webhooks and copy secret key and paste it right here and click on yes, continue. So once that's done, I can see that my business books and pops has been added. So I click on save and continue. Now, this is just a sample of a new customer, which is basically a transaction that has been done on my business. So I can click continue. The next step after this is to select an action step. Now an action step is simply what happens after the trigger. So as a result of the trigger, the action step takes place. In this case, what we want is that when something happens on Paystack, a corresponding action should take place on HubSpot CRM. So our action app is going to be HubSpot CRM. So we click on that and then we select the action we want. In this case, we're going to be creating and updating a contact. So we select that and click save and continue. So once we have that, we would need to connect our HubSpot CRM account. Okay, so I already logged in. So save and continue. Now, the next thing we're going to need to do is basically match fields that come in from Paystack to corresponding fields on HubSpot CRM. So what we want is when an email address comes in from Paystack, it should be attached to the contact email address on HubSpot CRM. We can also add the customer's first name. We get that from Paystack as well. And the customer's last name. We can also include a contact phone number. So once we've selected all of that, come over here and click continue. Now, we're going to take a look at our HubSpot page right now. This is contact, we don't have any contacts. So we're going back to Zapier. This is a sample transaction from Paystack that has now been matched to HubSpot. So we're going to do a quick test to send these details to HubSpot CRM. Now it says it's been done and we click finish. So let's come over to HubSpot CRM and refresh. And we see the information from the transaction is right here. So now we can go back and name our Zap contact updates and turn it on. So what this means is that when next customers try to make transactions on your Paystack business, the information is immediately updated on HubSpot CRM. Thanks for listening.